Stephen and Carolyn, we all know the mayor had an awful lot to say tonight. He used Focus Hope out here as the backdrop. It's known for its workforce development out here on Oakman on the city's northwest side. The mayor tonight, he talked about building up neighborhoods. And another 30 million as we move across the neighborhoods. Detroit Mayor Mike Duggan talking about the city's comeback, calling the demolition of vacant homes a matter of life and death, ensuring 10,000 homes will be torn down over the next two years, joking it will be done following all federal laws. But schools, of course, are the major issue in going to college. He announced the Detroit Promise is now growing. Any student with a 3-0 and 21 ACT can go to a four-year college now, tuition free. I have just such confidence in the new interim superintendent, Alicia Merriweather, who's an educator running the district, not a CPA, and the new school board. And if they get a chance, uh, I'm confident they're going to put teaching first. And with the comeback of Detroit, concerns about residents being forced out, too costly to live in the city. I want you to know that this mayor and this council are going to do everything within our legal power to keep your housing affordable. Everything he's talked about, I'm going to keep on him about it to make sure that this city is a city for all. Duggan also announcing $30 million for city neighborhoods, rehabbing homes, moving small businesses into vacant storefronts, even bikeways. How can we build the people up from the bottom? I know we're going to do big business here. It's coming. But I want to make sure we incorporate that with small city and everyday citizens. You talked about jobs. He also talked a lot about jobs tonight during his speech. He announced a new job initiative called Detroit at Work. It's on the city's website right now, linking folks to job training programs. For now, we're live in Detroit, Aaron Baskerville, 7 Action News. Certainly sounds promising, too. A lot of things he said tonight. Thank you so much, Aaron.